Oh shit, it's recording. Okay. <laughs> Hello guys. Hello. Well, where do I start? I am making this video to apologize. It's it's a video where I apologize to you. I owe all of you an apologize for disappearing out of nowhere without saying a thing. Um so my last video was like two months ago, a cuphead video, and since then there has been like a lot of stuff, a lot of stuff, uh, I cannot speak, uh, a lot of stuff happened. First of all, I enjoy my vacations, I enter into, well, for you it's winter, for me it was summer, <laughs> summer vacations, and I went to Spain, fucking lovely place, it was beautiful, I went to Madrid, to... Salamanca, to uh, Burgos, to a lot of places, everything was beautiful, everything was like a mixture of rural, like old city and modern city, somehow they managed to combine those two things and it looked amazing, I love Europe, I love Spain, I wish I could have visited other countries like, I don't know, Portugal, Maybe pay Brandon a visit on UK. <laughs> but anyways, after that, uh, I spent like three weeks, two weeks, three weeks, kind of. Then I came back, and as soon as I came back, uh, my sister, uh, which I love, by the way, I love a lot, my sister, she called me, she was saying, like, basically, like, hey, Jack, we have a open post for you. You want to come work with us? Because I've been working, I got a job now. I, I, I already said that I got a job, I think. But it was like more like a, an intern thing. This is more like a job thing where I get paid and shit. And usually uh, I spend my last week of vacations working. After that, uh, my classes started and it became hell for me because I wake up at 6 30 in the morning go to work spend two hours and a half in a bus because that's how far it is unfortunately I live in a very far away place um, two hours and a half go work 6 p.m. get out go to study until 10 I just came back from it's it's 10 18 p.m. and I just came back from from uh, cult from my art academy I'm sorry I just as you can see I took a bath because I was stinky I always end up stinky and it has it has been such a track for me to get used to this new lifestyle where I just get like two or three hours of free time which usually I don't have I usually spend these hours doing homework I usually spend all night doing homework and I'm uh, sorry, I'm sorry, burp. Uh, I sleep like two hours, three hours, then I gotta wake up, uh, and then I have to go to work. I usually fall asleep in the bus until I arrive to my destination. And in that time, homework, studies, work, it hit me hard. I lost motivation. I got somewhat depressed. I couldn't do the things I loved. And I kind of gave up on YouTube. And that was a hard hit on me. Because I felt like I failed you guys. I failed myself. I failed, I failed my friends. And I wasn't, I wasn't happy with my material actually. I wasn't happy with my pronunciation. I wasn't happy with me saying fuck and cursing all the time because I couldn't... I couldn't think in smart commentary and that's what gets me uh, I feel like I wasn't putting my 100% in my videos and the uh, part where I say that I failed my friends well this, this part is gonna be very personal for me it's gonna hit me hard it still hits me hard when I talk about it oh boy 
four or five years ago, I had two friends, online friends. Let's call them Joe and Jean. We played league together, we became such good pals. They helped me a lot because I was very shy. I'm still shy, but at least they helped me a lot. They helped me be happy with who I am. They helped me get out of my shell. I owe them a lot. Joe and Jim. We used to joke. I mean, we used to play a lot, and then we used to joke. I will have an own YouTube channel. Um, we used to watch Game Grumps, Mark Blair, Jack Septicai, all that together in that same call. We used to commentary and have fun and joke about having our own channel. All of us, the three of us, having a shared channel and do gameplays together or maybe one by one, you know, stuff. Um, one day, I, I, I had to go. I say, hey, goodbye, guys. I need, I need to go to sleep, etc., etc. One week passed. Didn't hear of them. They, I didn't saw them connected. Two weeks, three weeks, one month, two months. I messaged them, Facebook, Geek, Snapchat. They didn't answer. That probably was one of the most. Horrible things that will happen to me because I got stressed. I've, I got very stressed. I thought that they were avoiding me. They blocked me. They wanted to talk to me. I sent them messages. Please answer back. I'm sorry, whatever I did, etc., etc. And it, uh, four months later, I found the brother of Joe. Joe. Uh, I talked to him. I called him. He answered, and then I just went at it. I was like, what the fuck? What is happening? Why are they, why are they un they're not answering me? What the fuck? <laughs> he stood all my rant. He he didn't say anything. He just stood silent all of my rant. I was like, what the fuck is Joe and Jim doing? They think they just can block me, and etc, etc. I was just furious. I was exploding after all of the stuff I I had to go through. I still remember his words, he told me exactly, after I was done, he told me, you don't know, do you? And I was like, I don't know what. Apparently, Joe and Jean went into a movie, together with Joe's mom. I forgot to mention, Joe and Jean, live, uh, they were friends in real life. They were going to see a movie, I forgot which movie, I'm sorry. And this dude, this random guy, decided to, it was a great idea to fucking smoke shit tons of weed and booze and etc. He ran into Joe's mom car. Thank God, she got away, but... I'm sorry. Yo... <clears throat> I'm sorry. Yo and Dean didn't make it. He... He hit, he hit his head. He he went to, and I guess it was a quick way to go. It was instantly. He passed away from internal hemorrhage of the brain. And Jean, on the whip whiplash, just. She, I don't know how to put this in easy words, but she snapped her neck. Thank God, they both went 
instantly, painlessly. I couldn't believe it. On the first place, I, I was like, no, I don't believe it. This is a joke. You're lying to me. They're just making all of this shit up, so I forget about it. But no. Um, it was true. He showed me pictures. He showed me evidence that they could have made it. It hit me pretty hard. The fact that two of my best friends who I owed a lot, they were gone. Forever. And I could even say hi properly. I mean goodbye properly. And I spent these months. Those months. Hating on them. Anyways, I went into a serious depression. I lied to a lot of people. I downgraded my grades a lot because I couldn't bring myself to do stuff. I was sad, lost. I didn't have. I was fucked up. I would cry myself to sleep. I would want to do shit. I would avoid clashes. Until I met Brandon. Being of Brandon. He is a marvelous, wonderful person. He always tells me that no, he's an asshole. And that's not fucking true. I mean, yeah, sometimes, but. Aren't we all sometimes? He saved me. I love him that he, he was my brother. Without him, I could have done shit. And one time he told me, Hey, you're funny. Why don't you do YouTube? When he told me that, he inspired me. He still inspires me. He's a great inspiration for me. He did. Marvelous things for me. Even though he doesn't notice it or he doesn't acknowledge it, he is a great person for me. And the thing is, <clears throat> the main reason why I'm doing YouTube is because of people like him, my friends, people like him, and Joe and Jean, they both. are two of the main reasons for me to do YouTube. I like to believe like I'm somewhat keeping their spirits of their memories alive by doing this. That uh, making people's lives better, people's days better. There's nothing more wonderful than when someone that I'm talking to tells me, you made me laugh, you made my day better with your videos. <clears throat> Those two reasons are the are why I'm doing YouTube, and me going silent for two months without saying anything, without getting depressed and shit because all of this, it hit me hard because I feel like I feel dead. I feel Joe. I feel Jin. I feel Bin. I feel all of you, and I'm sorry. I'm real sorry. Maybe some of you will be like, why are you getting so sentimental for a shitty YouTube channel with 60, 76 subscribers? Those 76 subscribers mean everything for me. Because they take the time to see my videos, to comment. I feel like, even though I'm such a small channel, I can make a difference in someone's life. In one life. And that makes everything worth it. I 
Anyways, those are the origins of me as a YouTuber, of why I'm making YouTubes. And now let's, I don't know, let's go to a more no so depressing topic. Uh, uh, yes. I'm sorry, I'm gonna use these shorts. Ugh. Oh my god, I'm gonna have to clean that later. Whew. Wow. I've been struggling a lot to make this video. This is like the 15th time I'm trying to make this. Because the or this story, the background, a lot of all of this here is pretty hard for me to say. Until lately. Right now I'm making this video because of Brandon. Like I said, he inspired me. He inspired me to do this video. And I feel like it's time for me to stop procrastinating, to be lazy, to be stupid, to be ungrateful to you, guys. Ugh. You really don't want to see what I see. <laughs> Fucking my poor short. Mom is going to kill me after this. Oops. Well, now to the future of my channel. I'm gonna try to upload as many videos as I can with regularity. Granted, there are gonna be no way. Ne that nail though. Sorry, there was a nail that was literally fucking with me all the time. Uh, <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm an emotional miss. Uh, I'm gonna try to upload as much videos as I can. With my webcam. I'm gonna use this webcam now. I have proper lighting. As you can remember, I used to have a bunker bed. And I told my mom, you know what, this is bothering me, blah, blah, blah. And from uh, one day I come from my academy and she fucking saw it off by herself. She fucking ripped off the other half, the upper half of that bed. <laughs> what the fuck? All right. Uh, I love my mom. She, she's the best. She will do anything for me. She, she's a great person. She... She's one of the. She made me who I am today. Yeah, I made that. Of course, obviously. Anyways, um, I'm gonna use my webcam now. I'm gonna be to try be more expressive to you guys. I'm gonna try to. I had problems with my laptop. I had, again, with a memory with a hard drive, it fucked up again. I don't know how. Uh, I could save a lot of stuff. Luckily, it was savable, but I lost memory, I lost data, I lost games a lot, I lost Outlast too, and it, it really bothers me because now I, w I will have to do the same shit as Bioshock and the other games, I'm gonna have to wait till I have the time to complete it to the point where I was, because now it's, it's gone, it's all gone, I lost Dark Souls, I lost Cuphead, Shovel Knight, luckily I saved it, yeah, I could save it. I lost my online games, League of Legends, I had to re-download it again, it was a mess. I had to recover a lot of stuff. Luckily for me, I didn't progress too much in Dark Souls, you know guys already know that. I recovered it, I already have it. I don't think I can continue Outlast, Outlast again, I will have to you know, put it on background. My mom is making noise in the kitchen, god damn it. I'm gonna have to put it on stop. I'm so sorry if you guys enjoyed it. I'm so sorry if you guys are disappointed for me not finishing it. I will, I promise you, I promise all of you, I will try to go back to it again. Uh, I'm such a whimper guy. <laughs> Anyways. I will continue Dark Souls. Like I said, I'm try I'm, I'm literally using my, my few hours my few free hours to you know go back where I was in every game. Like I said, uh, Cuphead, it's gonna be a bitch. But I think I can actually play it all to the point where I was in time. I won't take too long to upload other videos of Cuphead. 
I got Trouble Knight, Dark Scroll 3, which one? Which one? Which else? <sighs> Whatever. Oh, Night in the Woods! I, I saved that too. Luckily I didn't lose that. I will keep continuing doing that. But like I said, out left, out the picture, out of the picture until ne news. <laughs> New news. I'm oh, sorry. Uh, I'm gonna try 100% to improve my commentary, uh, better and funnier edits, more collaborations. Also, I bought Game Maker Studios too, which will allow me to develop my own game. I, since I was a kid, I loved games. I always loved games. And now that I have the opportunity to create my own game, it's an opportunity I cannot lose. So, one day I'm gonna keep all of you up to date with that. Maybe I will. Maybe sooner, or maybe later, but eventually I'm gonna give you news about it because I'm excited about this project. I'm coding alongside with Ben, and I cannot code for shit. <laughs> Brendan already does, and he, he, he was, he was self taught, taught, taught. And you know what? He teaches himself, and he, I'm um, learning a lot from him. He's helping me a lot. I couldn't have, like, I cannot stress enough how he means a lot for me because he helped me in so many areas in so many times in my life. Not only him, but a lot of people. Jake, Jesse, Justin, Susie, Austin, Jacob. A lot of people. And all of you. Jojo. I cannot leave out. I cannot leave out. Jojo, Daya, Skyler. I'm sorry. I'm sorry for that once I'm leaving out. Trust me. I love all of you. If you're watching this, of course. All of you mean a lot for me. Um, um, very glimmer says, I want to live for you. Is, don't spend time hating on each other, have a conflict. Spend your time with your friends. As, just. Fucking Mortimer is screaming, <laughs> my cat. <laughs> Anyways, spend it with your friends to the max. Have fun. Live your life with your friends because you never know when you're gonna lose them. God for God forbids if that ever happen. It it can happen. It happened to me, and it will. Ha I will hate to see someone go through what I went through. So please. Love each other, just love each other, don't waste your time ha having grudges or hate, just that. Well, that's a big weight out of my chest. <laughs> Finally, I'm gonna come back to YouTube. Sooner or later in these days I'm gonna upload another video. Maybe Dark Souls, maybe Fortnite, because I have, I, have, I recorded Fortnite with Brandon and Jesse. <laughs> it was pretty fun. Uh, and, uh, Keep you guys on update. To whoever stick with me in this video, thank you so much. It really means a lot to me. Uh, I'm back. I'm back. Thank you for coping with me, guys. I cannot really stress enough. And of course, I'll see you in the next episode. Bye-bye.